Tonight, it is the end of a rocky road. The campaigning is done, the polls are closed, and the ballots are being counted. Now the outcome of California's historic recall election lies in the hands of the state's 22 million registered voters. Welcome to our special coverage of the California recall election, and good evening. I'm Micah Ullman. Hello, everyone. I'm Sandra Mitchell in tonight for Sheriff Calvin. Of course, KTLA 5 is your local election headquarters. Tonight is the culmination of a recall campaign that struggled to gain support in its early stages, but the pandemic coupled with the statewide shutdown and that infamous dinner at the French Laundry restaurant in Napa Valley kicked the recall campaign into high gear. There are a number of candidates looking to unseat Governor Gavin Newsom. They spent the last several months stumping for voters. All right, so it is 8 o'clock in Southern California. Polls now closed across the state, but there are still long lines. Look at this, the picture from Sky 5. Long lines outside the Edison Community Center. This is Huntington Beach. We can tell you that everybody that's already in line when the polls closed will get to cast their ballots. So we are watching that. We're also watching the results, awaiting results. Two questions on the ballot. That is it. Question number one, should Governor Gavin Newsom be recalled? This is a pretty simple one. It all comes down to this. If more than 50% of voters in California vote yes, Governor Gavin Newsom will be voted out of office. If, however, less than 50% of voters vote to keep Gavin Newsom in office, the second question then comes into play, that being, if Newsom is recalled, who should replace him? And you see the list of uh, the front runners at this point. Obviously, the polls just closing, closing uh, less than two minutes ago, so the results uh, are forthcoming in moments. We will have them uh, and update them uh, live for you throughout the hour here tonight and potentially beyond. We have a panel of experts joining us throughout the night. As the results come in, we'll check back in with the panel in just a few moments. The governor and the Republicans and some of the Democrats who want to replace him have kicked up their campaigns in these final hours. Now we'll see how it all shakes out. John Fidelio, live in Sacramento, covering the Newsom campaign tonight, John.